Hey guys, today is Saturday. I'm just starting the vlog at 1.20. I did have like some clips before this, but I spent basically the entire morning doing some outlining for Torts and Civ Pro and I did some homework for Civ Pro and uh, took a few hours. So after that, I took a shower because my hair was just too much. And now I'm getting ready. I don't have any specific plans today, but um, if I don't like get ready, I'll just stay in my pajamas all day. And I hate doing that, especially on a Saturday because a lot of the times I do that on Sundays and doing it two days in a row is just like depressing. <laughs> so I got a new shade of the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation because it's my all time favorite foundation. If you watched my other vlogs, you would know I tried out the Dior Forever foundation and I loved that, but it oxidized really bad and I even got the lightest shade and it still oxidized. So I went down like two shades in Estee Lauder and I got the neutral one instead of the cool, but I feel like this is like yellow, like this isn't really neutral and it's still too dark. So I think today I'm going to have to go and exchange it again for a lighter color because this is like really yellow. But no one at the Ulta that I go to like ever wants to help you. They just kind of like walk away. So we'll see. I also got this powder from Make Revolution because I finished my airspun powder. And this is like the worst thing I think I've ever put on my face. It literally turns your under eyes or wherever you put it completely white and it's terrible and it makes your under eyes look like you haven't moisturized or like drank water in like 10 years. It's like really bad. So I have to return that. I'm just gonna go buy my airspun powder at Walmart or Kmart or CVS. I can never find it at Ulta or anything. So I just have to get rid of that. I think it was only like $8, but it's terrible. Like you, I just cannot find a use for that. So I'm just gonna exchange it because it's so bad. And I wanted it to work too, cause it's like in a cute little container. I feel like it's supposed to look like the Ben Nye stuff. Is it Ben Nye? Ben? Is it Ben Nye? I don't know. Whatever that brand is that makes like the original banana powder that comes in that kind of case. I'm feeling like Ben Nye is that science guy person. So I'm really not sure, but I'm trying to incorporate talking and not talking into these get ready with me parts because I got pretty much like a mixed opinion. Some people were saying that they don't really like them and a lot of people were saying they do. So I'm just gonna do a little bit of each and then some vlogs won't have any, some vlogs will have all sped up, you know, just keeping it mixed up. But I personally enjoy watching Get Ready With Me's. Like, they're pretty much the only beauty videos that like I enjoy watching, but I also really like favorites videos. But like I don't watch really tutorials.
into the car. Um, I changed into a turtleneck because I could not deal with that other outfit. Black turtleneck, jeans, my Steve Madden slides. We're going to get Jesse food and then we're gonna go. We're gonna go to an eyeglasses place in the mall because I really need glasses. So I just need to do it instead of like saying I'm gonna order them online. I know I won't like them if I order them from a site where you can't try them on first, so. Yeah, just, I mean, if you can't try them on then you just have to keep returning them or? I they, guess, right? I don't even know. But that just seems annoying, like I need glasses, so. You guys like my new, uh, can't say shades, but men's, my new shades. Men's sunglasses. <laughs> Um, yeah, I had to get them from the men's side because all the women's glasses that my insurance like would have covered were really tiny for some reason. They were like grandma glasses. They were my face glasses. And then the other ones, like I don't want to spend $200 on one pair of glasses. I just don't. So I got these from the men's side and they are amazing and they were able to put them in like the same day. Usually I feel like they have to order. And by same day, within 30 minutes. Yeah, we went to Ulta, returned stuff, went to H&M, that was it. Anyways, I'm gonna go home and do my hair and then probably just go to Corey's, so. Let's All right, see. I wanna show you guys our new Christmas tree. Just got home and got ready. Just waiting for Corey to be ready, but anyways. We got this rose gold tree from Target. It's so freaking cute. It's more of like champagne. Like I wouldn't really say it's rose gold. It doesn't look pink at all. So I would say it's probably more like champagne colored. And then I just have some ornaments on it that are just from various places. This one's from Walmart. It's like a bird in a cage. That's from Walmart. That disco ball thing's from Walmart. And then I just have like these snowflake ones and some stars and whatever. I wanted to keep it simple because I feel like the tree is like a statement in itself. And it's only six feet and it's really thin. So if you guys have like not that much space for a Christmas tree, this is like perfect. So I just straightened my hair because it was kind of like frizzy from just being wet. And just put it in a clip so it's out of my face. I'm wearing the same turtleneck as I wore to the mall this is from h&m no it's from forever 21 i just got it so you can definitely still buy it it's like i don't know what material it is but it's really soft light wash forever 21 jeans and then i'm just gonna wear brown booties just to be comfortable i don't really know what we're doing if we're just like gonna hang out go to someone's house or like go out but I'm not changing because I'm so comfortable. Anyways, um, I got the double wear foundation. I just switched to the lightest shade. I had one and two, I think, and this is one and one, and this is ivory nude. So it should be the right color. And one of my nails fell off yesterday. And by fell off, I mean it chipped and then I bit it off. So this finger is like really gross. Just gonna wait. It's 4.40, so Corey said 5.30. So I have to wait like half hour to leave. And that's all. So I will catch up with you guys later. I never vlog on a weekend or on the weekend. So you guys never see me go out and do social things. But I swear I do have a life sometimes. I think since it's been like Thanksgiving break, since I've had so much like time, I've just been hanging out with people left and right. And by hanging out with people, I mean going to Corey's house. But that's where I'm going now, it's 5.30, so we'll see where the night takes us. I'm really not sure what we're doing, but we'll see where the night takes us. I'm gonna stop vlogging now, because it's dark. Of course, you can still see me. I thought it was gonna be a good ending, but it's not.